Tonight we are hearing a new side to the story of a social media video that many thought showed a dog being abandoned by its owner. The man in that video is talking about it tonight. He says he never owned the dog and is a lover of animals. 17's Aton Wallace spoke with him today and joins us now with more. Aton. Danny Powell says he was minding his own business on his daily walk near Lake Ming when a dog he never saw before, he says, approached him. He says the video does not portray what really went down, and tonight he wants his name cleared. It's a video many thought showed an owner abandoning his dog. Well, tonight the man seen in the video is speaking out. Oh, everybody that knows me will know, you know, that I like animals, that I'm not going to do that to one, you know. Robert Powell, who goes by Danny, says he was minding his own business at Lake Ming Wednesday, there on his daily walk. The man who says he does not, nor has ever owned a black dog, was on the walk to take care of his health. This is the scar where... They had removed my kidney. Just over a month ago, Powell was diagnosed with kidney cancer. He says he goes on walks near the lake as part of his recovery. When he was there for his daily routine Wednesday, he says he found the dog alone. We were driving along behind Lake Ming by the Powell's Boys Camp back there, and we seen a stray dog up the top by the gates where they're closed. So, you know, we stopped to see what it was doing up there, you know, because it looked like somebody had dropped it off. So we fed it a little peanut butter cup thing. And the dog started following us, jumping on the car, all excited, you know. Felt bad because it was a good dog. He says after that, the dog followed the car, at which point Powell got out once more to interact with the animal. It was then, he says, when the video was taken, that many thoughts showed an owner abandoning the dog. The Black Lab mix was eventually picked up by officers with Animal Services and taken to KCAS headquarters, where it's doing well. Animal Services launched an investigation and went to Powell's house, where they searched his property and left this notice. Powell says they did not find any evidence that a dog ever lived there. And tonight, he wants his reputation restored. What do you want people to know about who you are? No, never done that to any animals, never would, you know what I mean? Never would want to. I wouldn't wish that upon any animal. That's not right, you know? Taking a dog out there and letting it starve, you know? That's not right. I mean, whoever did that should be punished for what they did, you know? They need to come forward for what they did, you know what I mean? Instead of someone else getting in trouble. The dog, since named Anakin, is healthy and safe at Kern County Animal Services and will be up for adoption starting Monday. In studio, Aton Wallace, 17 News.